congratulations on your new deal with the Rhinos. How does it feel to be heading into your third year with the club? Uh, it's so exciting. Um, I love Rhinos. I've always loved my time at the club. So, yeah, I just feel so excited to get started, um, especially with Liana coming in as the new coach. Um, yeah, just really grateful to have the opportunity to be in that environment again. And um, I know it'll be a really good year because it always is at Rhinos. You mentioned there, Liana's coming. Have you had a chance to speak to her much? Are you excited to be working under her? Yeah, just briefly. Um, we've both been a bit busy with Commonwealth Games stuff, but I've caught up with her um, and she sounds really excited as well to get started, which is good. I um, haven't met the rest of the squad yet, so I'm sure we'll get together and um, think of our own goals. Um, but what I've heard, it is a really, really strong squad, so we'll definitely be aiming high and um, looking to improve on um, not just last year, but our first year. Um, and you coming back to Leeds coincides with you returning to education. Just what what will your year involve next year and what, what will you be doing? Yeah, I'm going back to study um, pharmaceutical development at the University of Leeds. So I'm going to be a master's student um, next year. So yeah, just studying alongside playing, which is what I'm used to. So I'm actually looking forward to getting back to that. And some people might not know that, obviously, along with your studying and working, you also combine it with... Gaelic football doesn't it so how does your week combine you there's a lot of travel isn't there going back to yeah home. um I try to fit in football wherever I can Um, it's obviously difficult during the season especially being in the game day 12 now um but yeah just kind of needs a lot of communication and working with coaches and making sure everyone's happy with where I'm at and what I'm doing making sure I'm happy as well um but yeah it's something that I love to do so anytime I get to fit it in I'm really keen to do it and just what's next for you when we when are you back with the squad? Um, I think October our preseason starts, but I have World Cup qualifiers the first week in October. Um, so I'll be out um of the first week of preseason just playing at them and then once that's over I'll be straight in, I think. You were a regular in in the squad last last season. How much did you enjoy that extra game time and what did you learn last season? Yeah, it was so good for me. Um it was my first time really ever getting a lot of court time in Super League. Um, so yeah, I learned so much last season and I really enjoyed it. Um, yeah, looking back, it was a really, really fun year. Yeah, just as you mentioned there, you've been away with Northern Ireland with the Commonwealth Games. How did you make, to, what did you make to that experience? Yeah, Commonwealth Games was really good. Um, it was a really tough few days for us going in as the lowest ranked in our pool. Um, but we were happy to come away with 10th. Um, we went into the tournament ranked 11th, so to move up one rank in place, we're certainly going in the right direction. Um, and we're all keen to push on now. So yeah, the girls all loved it. I loved it. Um, and it was such a good experience for us all as a team.